But in 2012, uh, on Christmas Eve, my mum was diagnosed with uh, colon cancer. It was stage four, um, and it was in uh, lots of secondary places as well. Um, and so it was just me and mum living alone. And so in 2016, early 2016, she passed away from complications. Um, and that's when I connected up with Canteen, um, just kind of after it all, because it was, it was very isolating as I was the only one in the house with her. It was quite alone. I moved in with um, other family members, but they hadn't quite experienced what I had. Uh, yeah, as I said, it was super isolating when I uh, when she passed away, and I just didn't really know what to do with myself. Um, and she had mentioned Canteen before she had passed away. We just never had got round to it, and so I was able to connect with other people whose parents had had cancer, and so we were able to share our experiences and kind of just bond and kind of um, feel the world out with each other and know that we weren't kind of alone, which was really great. I think that we're all here because of something not great happened in our lives, um, but at least something good came out of it. We got to meet each other and we get to go and have these distractions, um, which is really helpful for like your mental health, just to have these distractions to go on things and have genuine fun again, um, whether that be, yeah, four-wheel driving or we're going horse trekking or back in Dunedin we went to laser tag. It was just things like that where you could be an actual kid again because sometimes uh, when you're in certain situations you don't get to be a kid. Um, it really sucks so doing fun stuff like that is just really great to be a kid. <laughs>